Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the Dungeon 6 of Skyward Sword Blind Run thingy, of which I still don't know what I've named up to this point, but that is okay, because I'm making this all on the same day. And, wait, we're back? No, this is di a different room, because there's two of those hand, like, hand guys there. And, is this boss music? Something tells me I should just, like get onto one of these as fast as I can and just like, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, I get it. That last room taught me how to do this. Stab this critter like that. And now what I will do is um, cause them to freeze. Well, stop in movement. You know, with this, because I wasn't able to do this before. Like that. And... Yes! That is how it's done, baby. Now I have to get back up here quickly. Because <laughs> this is where I can get my plants from. And No, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to poke. There we go. Because I just wanted to get out my sword. You know, you, to get, the easy way to get out your sword is just to sling it. And that doesn't work very well when you want to, you know, preserve the thing that you're, you know, <laughs> trying to stab onto the sword. And you would think that uh, um, it would like, immediately pop those water fruit instantly, but I guess that's not the case. Oh, so that's how I can save that guy. Now there's no lava underneath him. Okay. And what, what did that other rock take me up to if I went up it, if I went up there? Thank you. Oh, so this is, this is adjacent to the room that he was in. Okay. Well, there's no lava, so I can't get up there again. Or was I up there? Doesn't matter which way I was? Probably not. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna go through this door. And see how to get that guy down now. Hopefully. <laughs> Maybe he'll give me a dungeon map. I'm always pondering about the dungeon map. Oh, I bet you that switch releases him. And it'll probably do it in a humorous way, knowing this game. Now he's getting released nice and slowly. Dang, I'm a little disappointed. <laughs> And I just noticed my heater turned on. And I typically don't want that in the recording. Um, no, not really. So I'm going to turn off my heater now. There we go. <laughs> mm. uh, well, that's what that other guy said, so yes. <laughs> I had no idea what I was getting into when I started this dungeon, so I'm just going to say yes. Hello? Okay. New item? New item? New item? Yes! Wait, Magma Mitz. Uh, so they're an upgrade to the digging mitts? So does that mean I can, like, dig down certain holes? Like, dig through to other floors or something like that? I don't know, I guess I'm gonna find out. Yes, I can, so... Oh, oh, oh! Oh my, now we're in 2D land. Um... What, what, did, what did that do? Uh, I can swing at things. What is this? Can I... Oh, I can break these things by sw swinging the Wii Remote, okay. Yeah, I've never used these before, so... I must... Uh, what? I'm trying to get a... Try pressing Z. Okay, so if I... Uh, okay, so this is going to be like two layered puzzles. If I hit this, I can move that over to whatever that is. Okay, that breaks that. And it appears I can't do anything about those crates as... Hiccup, excuse me, as they are. And I also noticed that I am running low on battery power. So that isn't good, I'll have to watch that, or maybe I'll do post-commentary if I have to for this part, if it runs out completely. I'll probably just stop at... I didn't mean on the Wii Remote, I meant on the camera! 
Okay, maybe this is a good time to stop this part because of the fact of all this stuff running low on batteries at the same time. So I'm just going to cut over to a new recording session now. Actually, I got a second Wii Remote, so I'm going to continue this part till the very last drop of camera power. <laughs> I forgot I had the other one on the charger, so I'm good to go, I guess. For a little while, I suppose. I just gotta watch everything carefully. Alright, so I can, for whatever reason, blow this lava rock with the gust bellows. Uh, yeah, I know it doesn't make much sense, but I can. Uh, so I can dig through there. And I can save over there, which is likely going to be handy for later. I should probably do that now for, like, a checkpoint with the camera and all. So I'm going to do that. Wah! There we go. And now, if, I, if it runs out of battery for whatever reason, I can just resume uh, right where I left off. And do something that isn't actually blind. See, there it goes again. It, sh it told me I've got s six of those before. Now, why does it have to explain that to me every time I get one after I turn off the game? Why? And see, now it doesn't tell me about the ore because I already knew about it. I, I just don't... <sighs> That's one of the most annoying little functions <laughs> of this game. It doesn't make the game bad, it's just it's just one of those things of why can't I skip that text? Is there any way that I can keep, skip that text? And that apparently opens that door from another place, okay. So that means I will be able to just pop up from here. I don't know why I would want to hit that switch on the other side to make it, you know, flip back over because I would close my way. But I, I apparently can because I could hit the blue side of it. Okay, let's just go through here and see what's up, I suppose. Another lava area. I can snipe those guys before they snipe me. I'll take that guy out first because he's going to call for his family. At least I think that's that's usually what the higher one does. Some Oh, you called! Dang it! Why must you do that? <laughs> Why must you alert the populace of this? Ah, I was right about this being a return path. Soon, now I'll be able to go through here. This was where I battled that uh, Dark Lizaphos. Okay, I don't need to go through there again, obviously. That's just to open the pathway. And... I apparently want to jump down there, but I can jump across here if I want to. <laughs> I just thought I would try that for the fun of it, and it worked! Okay, there's some bombs. Maybe I should replenish my bomb stash as long as I'm here. This is another nice feature they added in Skyward Sword, is that you're able to pluck live bomb flowers, or I should say wild bomb flowers, and uh, add them to your bomb stash. So it's not like you either have to grind for bombs other ways, like either by hoping to... Oh, I got my, my thing's full. <laughs> by um, either hoping to get it by cutting grass... Or by um, uh, buying them or something like that. And whenever you see blue butterflies, play your uh, uh, harp. Forgot the name of it offhand. And, and I thought I'm supposed to. Yeah, I thought I'm supposed to hit this thing with. Oh, I, I wasn't close enough to it. Okay, now I'm supposed to draw a triangle into it. That was a pretty bad triangle, but I hope it registers. It did. And you get some prizes for whenever you do that. Uh, I don't know if it's important to do that throughout the entire game. Because I know that there's a bunch of them that you can uh, get, or find, excuse me, that are around, around those butterflies. And what am I supposed to do here? Can I, like... It's like I'm trapped here with these bombs... Am I supposed to use the beetle to blow something up with them? Because yeah, I'm I'm otherwise pretty trapped here. <laughs> I'm going to attempt to like blow up a pillar. Ow! And that failed. So this is yet another one of those blind run type of moments that. Uh, should not occur in my videos and in, in my preferences. Oh, I see. 
I guess I was just supposed to do this all along. Maybe? Wait, wait, wait. Why, why can't... It looked like I could grab onto... Oh, there we go. So, okay, that that's... Is that where I was, or is that where I came from? Oh, okay, I'm going back in the direction that I was. Pretty sure I'm supposed to end up this way. And I'm gonna let go here. At least I think this is the right path. I don't have a map, and I have a bad sense of direction. <laughs> yep, this is a new guy. Looks like he is also trapped up there. Poor guy. They are apparently very easy to capture, despite them being able to burrow underground. Hmm. Well... Alright, alright, fine. <laughs> Ooh, big gigantic secret. Something else I'm gonna have to write down, otherwise I'll forget. Okay, so I gotta get him down. Somehow. So I got, probably gotta stab another plant to get it over there. I probably have to dig in here to get underground. Although I probably should have explored that other area first. <laughs> so let's do that first. I'll remember that hole. I mean, it's just it's just right there. Okay, that's it. <laughs> All right, to underground I go. Where can I go from here, though? That is the question. I can hit this. Eh. Uh, that opens that. I suppose. I bet you it's one of those puzzles that, that you have to keep that gate open while getting yourself out or something like that. Or, or open all the gates before you get yourself out. Maybe. Um, I might as well hit this one just to see what it does. Because I can hit it from the other side as well. Probably opens that gate. Or it blocks my path to get out. Interesting. Because I, I didn't see any other... Why didn't I try running under here before? It's a lot faster. Well, I, I can't run. I can crawl faster, though. Yeah, that blocks... No, wait, it doesn't block my path. Because I can just go... Like this. And like this. And then like this. And... Wait, wait, did I... Did I screw... I wasn't supposed to hit that switch, was I? Dang it! Blind run! That was this. what this was. Um, so that... Wait, it's that... Yeah, it was that switch that I wanted to hit. It's kind of interesting that I can't, like, switch the camera around if I enter the underground at a different angle. It's not that disorienting, but it, it's kind of up there. <laughs> Especially with my bad sense of direction. And, okay. Now that will keep the thing open. This appears to be the only way out of here, is this hole right here. So... There we go. And... huh? I... Huh? Um... I didn't... I didn't want to talk to you, I wanted to run. <laughs> yeah, yeah, hot tip, good for me. Um... Alright, so... If that opens... that... Does that mean that I want the gates to be... reversed in their openness? Like, reversed into what I have them at now? It certainly feels that way. Hmm. Uh, okay, so that gate corresponds to that one, I guess. Crawl faster, Link. <laughs> Don't run out of energy either, that'll be even worse. Eh. So I'm just gonna reverse the positions of these gates. For all I know, I was only supposed to hit that one over there. Hmm. Okay, that's the switch I'm looking for. To switch this one over. E. That will move it like that. Oh, wait, wait, but that blocks me from... 
Yeah, that can't be like that. Well, it, I, I can move it like that back over, but I wouldn't be able to reach. No, I would be able to reach if I took the long way around. But let's see what this gives me first before I go back and switch that last one back over. Okay, so that... Okay, so that one closes... Why did I run up the wall? I don't know. <laughs> oh, no, okay, this is open here now. Now if I were... Oh, I can't dig underneath through that hole. Well, what's the point of this right here? There's definitely some reason to come here. I think. <laughs> Maybe I'm supposed to try and get on top of there so I can stab one of those water plants. But wh where is there a path that lets me get up there, you know? I can't whip myself up there. There's nothing to grab onto with the whip. Hmm. I definitely need a plant, though, that's for sure. Like, this is, this is open now, but it's closed if I were to... That's probably the one over there that I need to stab, but... That gate is controlled by the same button, and you have to be underground in order to control this gate, which means I can't get up there fast enough to switch... Ah! <laughs> it seems impossible, but that can't be. This pa it probably has something to do with this. This being open here. Like, maybe I'm able to hop over the wall? No... Let's try... No, I probably should keep my claw shots. Uh, no. Not seeing anything. Where's that chain connected to, anyway? It is... through that grating. Hmm. Oh. Um... Ba oh! This one is supposed to be... They're supposed to be the opposite of what I have them right now. Okay. Why didn't I see that? See? Another blind run thing! <laughs> so I'm just supposed to switch these back over to what they were before. I think... Unless I'm gonna get... Trapped? I hope not. <laughs> All right, boink, and we gotta get over to the other one. Got a skedaddle. Still low on battery power, but it's still holding up somehow. I probably shouldn't jinx it. <laughs> um, how do I get over to there now? Or was I supposed to hit that switch first? Yeah, I was probably supposed to. Do this one first before I went over to the other one. Okay, that's that's fair enough. There we go. And now I go back over to the other one. And I go and stab a fruit. Throw it into the statue's mouth and hopefully save the game. <laughs> if not, I'll probably have to travel back over to a save point because I'm gonna be ending off this part soon. Okay, and let's see if this worked. Yeah, ah. I'm gonna have to take a bath after this. All right, so that's open now, and that's open. There we go. I would like to stab. I got myself a plant. It doesn't actually pop because you grab onto the ring apparently, or that dot. Throw it onto the thing. There we go. So it's not impossible after all. <laughs> Just as I figured. Now... But am I... Oh, I have to release him, like... So... I said, like... Link is gripping onto the wall a little bit too early. There we go! 
Yay! Woo! Now, what do you have for me? Sucker, what? Well, yeah, that would be... It would be pretty nice. Haha! -ha. Um, yeah, I helped him. Uh, dungeon map? I sense a dungeon map or a key. Hmm. Oh, survey it. Yeah, it is probably a dungeon map. A hidden room? What? Um, well, I'm not sure about that. I mean, this is going on to, you know, the interwebs. <laughs> oh, what? Where'd you come from? Freaking ninjas in every single game I play, I swear. Hmm. Breeze coming in. So, I probably have to bomb a wall somewhere in this room that I wasn't able to see normally. That was probably that other room. You know, the room that I was in that I thought had a purpose, but didn't actually... Oh, wow. Okay, so there's... There's a sacred flame. Yeah, it was a fake wall, just as I thought. Okay. Hidden route, huh? That I will find. Um, hopefully. <laughs> so, I, I'll, all I have to do is probably just... Um, flip that over, at least I think, looking at the map. Oh no, wait. It was in that other room. Right? No, wait, I, I'm getting confused here. Because <laughs> if I... Oops. It's, it was... Here. Now I move over to this room. Is it here? Let's, let's check the map. It looks like it's here. Um... Okay. I, it's probably something that I have to blow up. I'm trying to, like, feel for a hidden spot. But come to think of it, I didn't see any bomb flowers. Unless I'm just supposed to, like, randomly guess at it. Or maybe I'll, maybe I'll just do this. I'll do that, and then I'll walk up to the wall. And I'll just let it explode. Oh, it doesn't tell me if there's a secret wall there when I swing my sword at it. Very sneaky. Okay. Oh, this is going to take me to another underground. Oh man, this part's going on forever. Wait, what the heck are those critters? Oh, that's not a critter. It's it's a multiple critter. I bet you I have to hit him on his tail. Yep. Go, 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 go. Uh, 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 I, I sensed your weakness immediately. Head him off at the pass. No, I failed. I probably have to kill this guy. Not sure. Or maybe I'm just supposed to go through. I, um, I think I'm just going to go through. <laughs> I don't really feel like messing around with him too much. Alright, I'm here. Wherever here may be. Um, treasure chest. Key. That'll definitely be of use. Come to think of it, what was the the first? I mean, the basement floor? Oh, it's just one really, really big room. That's probably like the last of the room. I mean, last of the dungeon sometime around there. That's just my guess. Or it's like a lava raft area of sorts. What? What? What is? What is this? If I jumped on here, what does this lead me to? Oh. This is just leading me back over here. Okay, what I'm gonna be doing here is ending off the parts. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go save my game. Wait, actually, come to think of it, did I? Maybe. I don't. I don't know. This again, blind run thoughts right here, because I may have actually made a mistake there. Because it looked like that room was no, that that room isn't connected. So that means I have to go back and oh, this this I have to go. I'm gonna go save at this bird statue next to the locked door, and that's where I'm gonna end off. I should say end off this recording session. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you in the next blind part of Skyward Sword Dungeon 6.